Cal fans, the Cal dance team, and Oski. Cal fans, please welcome to the court. Andy Wolf, recipient of the 2013 Pete Newell Career Achievement Award. Joining Andy on the court is his wife, Peggy, Pete's son, Greg Newell, and Director of Athletics, Sandy Barber. Andy, you guys turn that way, turn that way. The honor is annually presented to a Cal men's basketball alumnus who has distinguished himself and his career accomplishments, upholding the highest ideals of Coach Newell in the University of California. Andy Wolf exemplifies these qualities, serving as a student ambassador for the program, both as a player and as a coach. He owns the distinction as the first player in school history to score 1,000 points in his career. Wolf completed his 97-game career in Berkeley, 1,112 career points, which ranks 31st all-time. A three-time All-Pacific Coast Conference selection, Wolf was a first-team All-American in 1948. He was a standout on the 1946 team that won 30 games and finished fourth in the NCAA under fellow legendary coach Nibs Price. Price named him the greatest player he ever coached, and when Price selected his five greatest players after 30 years of coaching, he described Wolf as a clutch player. Nothing much he couldn't do perfectly. An inspirational leader and an All-American in the true sense of the word. Wolf was part of the second class to be inducted into the Cal Hall of Fame in 1987 along with Newell. He was later inducted into the Pac-12 Hall of Honor in 2006. Wolf later served on Price's staff as an assistant coach from 51 to 54, winning 50 games over three seasons. Following a standout basketball career, Wolf became a member of a successful law firm in the Bay Area for more than 30 years. His success on the court transitioned into the courtroom as well, where he was selected to the American Board of Trial Advocates. And now a few words from Andy Wolf. Ready? Ready. Yeah. Uh, th this is an honor to uh, be the recipient of the Pete Newell Award. Uh, Pete uh, was a basketball coach who was an icon. And uh, his record speaks for itself. I've had an opportunity over the years to meet some of the uh, of Newell's players, and uh, I find that uh, when they talk about Pete, you can just hear the adulation that comes through. I would uh, like to share this honor uh, first with my teammates and coaches. The all here is a cow. You know, individuals are singled out sometimes to receive awards. However, individuals don't win games. It's the team that wins games. And thank you. The three years that I played here, we uh, won 75 games. So you know that I had a lot of great teammates and coaching. Matter of fact, one of my uh, teammates, Bob Hogeboom is here this evening. He was captain of the 1947 team. And thanks for being here, Hog. I also want to share this with uh, my wife, Peggy. <laughs> we met here on the campus in a physiology lab many years ago. The next year we were partners 
in anatomy lab. And in a year after that, we became partners for life. Anything that I have attained after our marriage is largely due to her love and support. And in all due respect to my teammates and coaches, she's, she's the best teammate I've ever had. Okay. One more thing. Go Bears. One more thing I'd like to compliment you. Uh, you know, they talk about the home team advantage. Well, all of you are the home team advantage. And boy, have you shown it this first half. Just keep it up for another half. I'd like to make one comment to the uh, student rooting section. And I was hoping to hear this after the Oregon game, but uh, it's when you guys start to chant and tell the whole damn world this is bear territory. Thank you. All right, fantastic. That's yours. Cal fans, a warm round of applause, 2013 Pete Newell Career Achievement Award winner, Andy Wolf.